Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about how to make the best of the summer before your senior year in reference to college applications and basically how to make the fall of your senior year a lot less stressful than it has to be. All these tips are things that I did and I completed the majority of my college applications over the summer. So the fall of senior year was a lot less stressful and I could really focus on school and my extracurriculars and keeping my grades up. So my first tip is to complete your Common App essay. Now, a lot of people this might be kind of difficult for if they're not really sure what to write their Common App essay about, but I suggest getting a start on your Common App essay and at least completing a draft or maybe an almost final draft. So by the time the fall of your senior year comes around, you're either almost done with your Common App essay or completely done. Or if you're not really sure which question to answer, you can write two essays and then you can choose the best one at the end of the summer or in the fall. And maybe you can send one of the essays to some colleges and one of them to the other because you can do that. Basically, just try to get your Common App essay out of the way so you can work on all the other stuff afterwards. My second tip is to have a pretty good idea of the colleges you're going to be applying to. Make sure that this is final by like the end of August or maybe even September because you're, the people writing your recommendations are going to need a list of all of the schools you're applying to and all of the applications if there's like the coalition or like the UC app or like there's just a separate way that they need to send the recommendations, they're going to need to know that and they're going to need to know all of your deadlines because a lot of teachers cap the recommendations based on deadlines so if you have a school you want to apply to early and that's like October 15th then you're going to need to know that right away so you get the teachers that you want to write your recommendations. So the summer is also a really good time to research colleges if you're not really sure which ones you want to apply to because also for some, a lot of the essays you're going to need to write why you want to go to this college and why you applied to it. So researching the college is going to be really helpful for those essays. So basically make sure that you have a good idea of the colleges you want to apply to and why you want to apply to those colleges. And it's okay if your list changes a lot, it's going to change. And if you're not interested in applying early, then your list can honestly keep changing throughout the fall of your senior year. Like that's not my recommendation, but if that's your position, like that's okay too. My third tip is to make a list of all the essays and materials required for those schools and the, and the specific programs or major you want to apply to. So make sure if there is a required supplemental application you need to fill out, or if you have to do a slide room, or if you have to submit an extra recommendation, or if you just have like supplemental essays, make sure that you have no surprises and that you have a list of all the things you need to do so then when you're done with them, you can just check them off. Having that list is just gonna be really easy for your brain to organize all of the stuff you have to do. And number four, get started on or try to complete the biggest things that you have to do. So I had to make a short film and do a lot of like creative writing supplements and um, extra essays. So I wanted to make sure that my short film was done over the summer because that's obviously going to take up a huge amount of time. And if you have an art portfolio or just a lot of extra long essays that you have to do, like some of my supplemental essays were like a thousand words as opposed to some of the common app ones that were just like 200 or 300. So basically just look through that list that you just made and think what is going to take the most time or what do I want to spend the most time on and try to get a good start on those or even complete them if you can. Because with school and everything that goes on in the fall of your senior year, you're really not going to want to be worrying about all of these really like long, huge, time-consuming parts of your applications. And number five, towards the end of the summer, once you've made really good progress, hopefully, make a list of all of the remaining tasks that need to be done. So hopefully this won't be too hard because you already have your list of all the stuff that you need to do. So hopefully you've been checking off all the things that you have done and then you can make a separate, hopefully shorter list of all of the stuff that is remaining that you still need to accomplish before, or that you still need to accomplish during the school year. Hopefully this helped you and I wish you the best of luck on your college applications.